Hello everybody, this is John Katsimidis of Cats in the Las Vegas Review Journal with my bro, Mark Chinook, late of uh, Rock of Ages and the founder of Monday's Dark in Las Vegas and The Space. Uh, we've had a couple of shows here at the Magic Mike Theater where we are now. Mark, you and I had a talk when uh, Rock of Ages opened about four years ago. Uh, right after the opening, and you told me your idea for Monday Start. Take me back to that point and how you got to this point. Uh, I'm supported. I had this idea where I was like, let's get our entertainers together and and get people to make a contribution or a small donation to an organization as opposed to just showing up to an event. You know, it's one thing to show up and as a performer and entertainer in town to show up to an event and lend your your show, your appearance to right. that event. But I thought, hey, let's, let's do something and, and get people to pay money and come and see what we do. The theme is prom night. The singers are Jason Allen and Autumn Grace Johnson, and the charity is Safe Nest of Las Vegas. More from Autumn Grace Johnson on the show that was held at Magic Mike Theater on June 22nd. No party would be complete without Chris Phillips, hey, Zoe hey, Bowie. Is, he is a new father, right as you will see here. That's your baby girl. Which one am I? I can't tell after Botox, we both look the same. And if I just still had John Cat's hairline, I'd still wear my hair like that. <laughs> well, if you don't mind, I'd like to dedicate a song to my prom date tonight, who is the mother of that child, if you saw her a moment. This is Jennifer Phillips. <laughs> has been embraced not only by my entertainer buddies but by the community itself all the charities and we set aside our our egos and our bs for an hour and a half and we make a difference for, for people who need it what you know is true don't have to tell me i love your precious heart Standing, and you were there, like two worlds colliding, and they could never tear us apart. What's the big, been the biggest revelation for you in this whole process? The big wow thing for you? Finding home in Las Vegas, finding a great core of friends here. Uh, still having the opportunity to go to Los Angeles and pursue other things, but really feeling like I belong here and I can make a difference. In Monday's Dark, they auction off a segment where an audience member can play cowbell, and this is what it looks like. Uh, Jason, you take the lead on this? I got it. We're going back to the 90s for about four minutes. Here we go. Monday's Dark, are you ready? Are we ready? Are you ready? Come on, now, let's do it. Because this is how we do it. This is how we do it. Challenge in New York. I was in New York for 10 years, LA for eight, and you battle. You're constantly battling for those auditions, the next mm -hmm. gig. Oh, yeah. But here I felt like our entertainment community, we all support each other. This is my friend and column favorite, Ann Martinez of Baz and the world's greatest rock show, and watch her rocket.
Kirby Long, late of Jubilee in Vegas the show, and now of Divas 3, takes the stage. You might not know this one, but he's a great one. Daniel Emmett, Knights in White Satin by Moody Blues. Playing our song to close out another Monday's Dark, Johnny Be Good by Chuck Berry. Dark, but there's a lot more programming, a lot more going on in the space than just Monday's Dark. What else do you want to talk about that's coming in that's not the charity show? Yeah, we got uh, the Game of Thrones parody in July, which is awesome. It's uh, started in the UK at the, the Edinburgh Fringe Festival in Chicago, Los Angeles, and it's going to come to the space for nine shows in July. I want to create a place where people like myself, professional entertainers, can learn to grow and, and continue to work on projects that are, are really just awesome grounded, artistic, passionate things. So we're going to start some programs where we can continue to learn. We're going to have an improv workshop that we're going to launch where we can take a class and continue to grow as performers. Uh, but just different, unique programming that you don't find on the Strip, you don't find at Smith Center, you don't find uh, downtown. It's just neat, awesome, grounded, rooted, artistic. Prom, folks. Looks good, doesn't it? Right? Great, a great color. I don't know about the cut. Yeah, no, the cut's horrible. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't even get it over my calves, but that's okay. <laughs> Mark Chinook, founder of Monday's Dark in the Space.